hello and welcome to my channel i am so glad that you are here because i'll be talking about a topic that is very important especially to women you see every woman needs to know this every woman needs to understand this men are fond of manipulating women in a relationship and because women don't understand the things that men do to manipulate them they fall for it every time so in this video I'll be talking about easy ways men manipulate women in a relationship my name is Chris and if you haven't subscribed to my channel please go ahead and subscribe and don't forget to turn on the notification so that you would be notified whenever I upload a new video. If you're ready for the show, I am ready. So let's dive into it. Number one, they make women believe that they are in love with them when in reality they aren't. You see, a lot of men understand that women love the idea of having a man who is in love with them, a man who loves them. And you can't really blame women for that because it really feels good to know that there's someone out there who truly loves you, someone that could do anything for you, someone that could move the world just for you. And when a woman finds that man, she could do anything for him. So men are fond of selling that lie, I love you, I love you just so they could have you where they want you to be, just so they could have you do whatever they want, just so they could get stuff from you. They understand that if they don't make you believe that they love you, there's a limit to what you can do for them. But the minute you believe that they love you, oh my goodness, you could literally move mountains for them. And sometimes it can be difficult for a woman to decipher whether a man loves her. Well, this is what you need to look out for. This is what you need to do. You see, actions speak louder than words. Talk is cheap. Don't believe a man just when he says that he loves you. Don't believe it because it could be a big lie. Instead, you should believe his actions. Does he do things that show that he really loves you? Can you tell by his actions that he loves you? If he's telling you he loves you and his actions don't match what he's saying, it's because he doesn't love you. You see, anybody can say anything. Anybody can say, hey, I love you. But not anybody can actually show you that they love you, okay? If a man is having a hard time showing you that he loves you, it's because he doesn't love you. Because if a man truly loves you, I tell you what, he would do anything. He would move mountains. He would do whatever he needs to do just to let you know how much he loves you. And you don't even need to ask him. He would do it willingly because it comes genuinely from his heart. Number two, men make women feel so insecure. They believe the idea that they aren't good enough for them. You see, self-confidence is a woman's greatest asset. As a woman, if you believe in yourself, you know that you are more than enough. You know that you are the best of your kind. You know that there's nothing that you can't achieve. There's nothing that you can't do. I tell you what, you will not tolerate nonsense from any man. So men try to, you know, break women. They try to make women feel like they are not good enough. And the thing is, they don't often do that directly. They do it indirectly by making subtle remarks, by doing little things that gradually break your confidence. Little things that gradually make you feel like you're not good enough. And the minute you feel like you're not good enough, you won't be in a hurry to leave the relationship. You feel that your options are limited, so why should you even bother? That's just a way for him to hold you down, okay? And you shouldn't let that happen. The moment you begin to feel that a man is trying to make you feel insecure, he's trying to break you down, that is your cue to look out for yourself. That is your cue to protect yourself and take a walk. Because if it lingers, I tell you what, you would be so broken that you would rather stay in there than step out because you would feel like 
he is the best you could ever have. The third way men easily manipulate women in a relationship is by using money to compensate for their bad behaviors. Women love money as they should actually. I think every woman should love money and I made a video about that. You can find the video right here and because men know that women love money, they throw money at women as a compensation for their bad behavior. So a man does something wrong, something that you should call him out on, something that he has to be remorseful about and you know apologize for. Instead of him to do that, instead of him to correct himself and make amends, he throws money at you hoping that his money would do all the talking, hoping that his money would have you where he wants you to be. And more often than not, it works because the minute men throw money at women, women forget about every other thing. They forget about the wrongdoing of those men. It's like money makes everything all right. As long as there's money, men can continue to misbehave. They can get away with anything. While it's okay to love money, while it's okay to, you know, enjoy yourself, live the good life, you shouldn't trade your happiness, you shouldn't trade your well-being for money. Because at the end of the day, if you're not happy, if you don't feel all right, no amount of money can make you feel all right. No amount of money can make you happy, okay? Yes, live the good life, but don't let men get away with their bad behaviors just by flaunting money, just by throwing money in your face, okay? You deserve more than that. You need to hold that man accountable for his actions. Even when he gives you all the money in the world, he still needs to do right by you as long as he's in a relationship with you and he is committed to you. The fourth way men easily manipulate women in a relationship is that they make a promise of marriage. A lot of women can't wait to get married. I mean the single ones. Marriage is like a very big deal for a lot of women and men know this. Single men understand this. They use that to their advantage, okay? They behave badly, they don't do right by you, and then they make you believe that they are going to marry you, they are going to spend the rest of their lives with you. And because a lot of women want to get married, a lot of women love the idea of being married, they let things slide. They overlook a lot of things just because they want to walk down the aisle, they want to, you know, be married. While it's okay to want to get married, you shouldn't shortchange yourself because of that. You deserve a man who would do right by you and marry you eventually without using it as a bargaining power. At the end of the day, it takes two to tango. It takes two to be in a marriage, okay? So if he thinks that he's doing you a favor by getting married to you, that's a flawed idea, all right? That isn't somebody that you should even want to get married to. Both of you are going to come together in that marriage. Both of you would live together. Nobody's doing anybody any favors. Both of you want it. He should want it as much as you want it too. Don't let any man treat you badly just because they want to marry you, all right? They're not doing you any favors, they aren't. Because if you think that a man promising you marriage, promising to get married to you is such a big deal, I tell you what, he's going to treat you badly. He's not going to treat you as the special woman that you are. He understands that at the end of the day, he can get away with a lot of nonsense just because you love the idea of marriage so much. The fifth way men easily manipulate women in a relationship is by emotional blackmail. You see, men are so good at emotional blackmail that they can have women do whatever they want. He begins to bring things up and, you know, changing the story, turning the narrative upside down just because he wants you to do what he wants. Naturally, women want to do right by their men. They feel terrible when their men accuse them of treating them badly. So you need to be vigilant. Is he fond of blackmailing you emotionally? Is he always turning the stories upside down just to make you look like the bad one? 
Is he fond of that? A man who truly loves you and cares about you wouldn't want to blackmail you emotionally, at least not intentionally. That might happen without even realizing it. But when it's something that he does over and over again, it's not a coincidence. That is his own way of manipulating you. That's his own way of getting you to do whatever he wants. If something doesn't go his way, he pulls that card. He pulls the emotional blackmail card. And there's a very high chance that it will work because half the time you're not even aware that that's what he's doing. You're not aware that he is trying to blackmail you emotionally. They make you believe that they love you when in reality, they don't. They make you feel so insecure so that you wouldn't want to leave the relationship because you feel like you're not even good enough for them. And if you're not good enough for them, how can you be good enough for someone else? They throw money at you to compensate for their bad behaviors. They promise you marriage. They make you believe that they're going to marry you. And for that reason, you overlook a lot of things that are not right. And finally, they blackmail you emotionally. I did a video titled signs that you're settling in your relationship. Your relationship isn't the best, but for some reason you are still there. Okay. You need to check out the video right here. Feel free to take a look around my channel. You will find lots of other interesting videos, okay? If you haven't subscribed already, this is a good time to do so. And don't forget to turn on the notification so that you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. It was nice talking to you in this one. See you in the next one.